Hey everyone, it's Tom Kradzer with another Rockstar Minute. And look, today I wanna to share one of the little money management techniques that has helped us the most over the last 20 some odd years. So look, when I first started making money, I would get paid by a paycheck. Um, and I'm thinking of my construction days when I worked with our father. Um, I'd get paid by a paycheck, I would deposit it in my bank account, and then I would just spend whatever I needed to spend. And I did that pretty successfully. I started working different part-time jobs. I used the same strategy when I first uh, got my first kind of career after university at Oracle Corporation same kind of thing but shortly after I began working full-time our mom decided she was gonna to go to some personal development conference or seminar in Alberta by some guy named T Harv Ecker and I'm like I don't know where you're going I better take some vacation time and go with you to protect you from whatever you're gonna go through here so I actually took vacation time didn't really tell anybody what I was doing I don't think I wanted to admit it at the time um, flew out to Calgary on points with uh, our, our mom drove up we rented a car drove up to Red Deer Alberta and I heard this guy get on stage T Harv Ecker and he said hey look if you're having trouble kind of achieving your financial dreams you probably have a money management issue and he broke out this series of like eight or ten different jars and I ended up buying a set of these things they were literally just plastic things I don't know why I bought them there and flew them home I could have probably just came home and got them at the, like the dollar store or something but I bought them I think because they had the fancy labels um, and they all had different labels this one's the only one I have left it's called the financial freedom account and the what he explained is that when you get paid put your money into one bank account or one jar um, and then you take a percentage of the money in, and dump it into the other jars all labeled different things so one is your financial freedom account one is your taxes account one is for vacations um, I used different labels so for example um, and Carol and I still use this today one is called for us cars and insurance the give account um, vacations children's education so we just take the money into one account um, that we've earned and then we immediately do all our transfers um, into all these other bank accounts when I got home from that seminar and I went to the Royal Bank to open up like eight different checking accounts and labeling them all differently to do this the guy at the bank just thought I was completely crazy he was trying to explain that I was gonna have all these different fees and you know it wasn't really wise to do this but I didn't care I didn't want to use the jars like in my house I wanted to do it electronically because I was getting paid electronically at that time and uh, we opened up all these different bank accounts we became which became our virtual jars and when we got paid we did that and it really changed my financial future. I'll never forget when I was working construction, I would get paid and I would just kind of spend. I was younger, I would just spend whatever money I needed to spend and whenever tax time came, the accountant would always tell me, hey, you owe this much in taxes and I never had it. I had to work like the next couple months to go and make enough money to pay for last year's taxes. It was like the most depressing thing. But whenever I changed to this little jar strategy, it changed my financial future. I was able to immediately start saving. Um, I was able to buy uh, some properties. I think I actually bought our first rental property before this jar strategy, but it definitely helped um, advance some of our real estate investing. And whether you're using um, getting paid via career or self-employed, or now Nick and I use that today in our business at Rockstar, uh, Carol and I still use this strategy for our own family. It's completely changed our financial future. And when I see anyone or when anyone asks us about money management stuff and I ask them if they're having trouble making payments on different things and sometimes they'll admit that they are I'll ask them if they're using this kind of strategy where they just immediately take money out of their account and transfer it over to a series of different accounts and they usually never are and as soon as they do that I always hear good results so this might sound embarrassing embarrassingly simple however for us it's what we needed and it really changed had a big impact anyway on our financial future so hopefully you find that useful until next time your life your terms